Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here and in this video, we will be doing the performance test on the new POCO F4 5G. So POCO F4 5G comes with uh, an AMOLED display, it's a full HD plus resolution display and you get the Qualcomm Snapdragon 870 chip. Uh, you get uh, 6 GB RAM, 8 GB RAM and also 12 GB RAM. So in this video, we will be doing the performance test, uh, we will be doing the throttling test, CPU throttling test and let's see if there is any throttling issues on this device. Along with that, uh, we will also see the anti to benchmark score as well as CPU or uh, rather the Geekbench uh, CPU scores and see how the performance of this device is uh, in this price segment. So we will be starting the uh, CPU throttling test first, then we will move on to the other test. So before getting into the video, if this is your first time on this channel do hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin the cpu uh, throttling test of the new poco f4 5g so let's start off first with the cpu throttling test so we have the cpu throttling test app installed and we're going to start with a 15 minute test so uh, you can see here this device uh, has uh, the uh, 12 gigabyte ram so we'll just uh, show you the settings so about phone you can see here uh, this is the 12 plus 3 gigabyte ram qualcomm snapdragon 870 chip and uh, poco f4 5g so let's uh, start uh, the cpu throttling test here and we'll come back once the uh, test is completed So now we are done with uh, the throttling test and you can see uh, the CPU throttle to 93% of this max performance so that's pretty good and you can see the maximum value 257 uh, uh, gips and here we have average values 247 and minimum is 229 this is in fact pretty good uh, for this price segment so the performance uh, or other throttling test uh, uh, on the POCO X4 or other F4 uh, 5G uh, did pretty well and uh, the throttling is uh, around 93% uh, of the max performance so that's pretty good value now let's move on to the next test that uh, we'll uh, talk about uh, the anti to benchmarking test so we'll see how much uh, uh, temperature it reads so we'll also check the temperature before going uh, so here you can see here after uh, the throttling test you can see the max temperature is around 37 degrees so uh, no heating issues as such so that's the temperature so let's go to the next test next uh, let's start the anti to benchmarking test so we have the poco f 5g with us so let's uh, start this uh, and uh, let's see the score after completing uh, the test So now we have completed the anti to benchmark score and you can see here uh, the CPU score, GPU score and the memory score. You can see here almost close to 7 lakh uh, is the uh, anti to benchmark score, 6 lakh 84,672. It's a pretty good score actually and uh, this is the Qualcomm Snapdragon uh, 870 chip. And uh, you can see that uh, even after the test, uh, the temperature seems quite normal. Uh, the CPU and GPU temperature is available here. So it's uh, no uh, real heating issues as of now. So let's go to the final test. That's the Geekbench test and see the results there. So next and final test is the Geekbench score. So you can see here, this is the Geekbench uh, app and uh, we're gonna start the uh, uh, test here. So we'll uh, run the CPU benchmark score here. So the Geekbench 5 uh, score uh, or other test is being conducted right now. And uh, we'll come back and uh, we'll uh, report the final values. So 
So here you can see the Geekbench score, uh, 90, 978 is the single core score and 3324 is the multi core score of the POCO F4 5G. So that was uh, the performance testing of the POCO F4 5G. So you can see here POCO F4 5G did a really good uh, uh, performance in terms of throttling as well as performance. So it is a pretty good device in terms of uh, pricing as well uh, at this price segment, this performs really well. So that was a performance test of uh, the POCO f4 5g so hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day